Alright, now I'm about to print. So, just did a test extrusion to make sure it's coming out real nice. So, now we're just going to start the print. This may be restarted several times. But, here we go. Alright, that's a uh, completed print. Let's just move that out of the way. Alright, let's take a closer look. Uh, I'll give it a second to cool. But just a cursory glance. Looks pretty good. Got nice fine layers on it. So, let's just move that a little more. So, let's uh, bring in, let's just get this off of here quick. There we go. Yeah, that probably wasn't supposed to come apart like that. Oh well. But this is the Assassin's Creed pendant I downloaded. Uh, I had to blow it up by I think like 800 percent to get it this big. I don't know how small they were trying to print it. I mean the first time I printed it it was about the size from the very tip here to this tip so tiny didn't have any detail really didn't mean anything so but this is the after scaling it up a bit, I mean, this is kind of rough still. I mean, not the best infill on this, so that might be in my settings. That might be a settings issue. Uh, but otherwise, looking at the sides here, got pretty good resolution on the side. I doubt you can focus enough on that, but yeah, really fine resolution there much better than I thought this thing could do but looks like I'm taking it off I broke it so no big deal super glue can fix that but a little cleanup needs to be done this is just support here Let's see if I can even get this off there's a hole in there at the tip so just gotta break this and this off and then run a drill through and then this pendant will be done I mean I'm still going to try and fill in some of these gaps or whatever, but not a bad little print. Uh, mostly wanted to see if this white filament was working right. Uh, looks like it's working pretty well now. Uh, mostly got some issues with the slicer program, so I'll probably fix that. But uh, yeah, that's one print run of 
the Assassin's Creed pendant. So, uh, hoping to bring you guys another print soon. Uh, if you have any ideas of what you'd like to see printed, just send me a link with the object in question, and I'll see if I can do it. Bear in mind, I only have a hundred by a hundred by a hundred millimeter print space, so small stuff like this is super cool. Um, I've done some puzzles, so if you want to see those or anything else, just let me know.